Hey, how you doing? This is gonna have a shot. I'm playing bass guitar for the first time. Um, I should close that door. Yeah, I should close that door. My dog's crying outside. And there we go. And I'm getting a bit of feedback on my on my iPad. I'm using my iPad to record. I've got AmpKit to record it. I'm using this uh, microphone called Workhorse 57, and it's running on a I'm a PV Valve King amp, and it's it's okay. I like it. I can even add effects to it if I wanted to, and I'm running it through a beat maker. Uh, this is what I bought today. Uh, um so the other way I never played bass before so I'm I'm with I'm a bit unsure whether I need to put it in the overdrive or whether. I'm not playing anything. difficult because the frets are a lot larger, that's one thing I noticed and, uh, and there's only four. See how I go, how it goes along, and uh, I'm going to record that one. Let me see now. Okay, so we're recording.
Wow, it's recorded, and uh, this is it's brilliant. It's recorded on. Uh, it's recorded that. I just get my speakers, and this is how I played. Uh, this is how it sounded on 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 the. Let me take that headphone off. And this is how it sounded. This is half. This is what is uh, the medium I listen to music on, and it's a bit lower than usual. Flexibility-wise, how much I can get out of this, um, and this guitar, and this this bass guitar, but uh, it's the first shot. I, I and uh, I can build around it. It can, uh, it can now, it can now. Uh, I can do things to that if I want to do. I can just add effects onto it. I can put beat pressure on it if I want, and overdrive to make it louder. It'll sound totally different. This is how it sounds. <laughs> and think well what chord am I playing here what am I doing here what am I doing there and you just, you just get down to it and start, and start jamming and just start playing and that's, that's, what, that's what it's made for really <laughs> quite creative guitar really quite creative uh, Jackson uh, Demon SD Demon bass guitar uh, so 
if I move that somewhere else, if I move that over here somewhere, now, you might be able to see what I'm doing it on here. And, uh, I can't see it because of the glare. That's what I'm doing. And this is my, this is my track here. Uh, it goes on for a long time. For, it goes on for 63 bars. Now these are the effects here, and you got a beat. I'll put beat crusher on there and overdrive. And so it sounds without overdrive. If you take overdrive off and you play, it. and I will just a bit of beat crusher. This is how it sounds clear. And if you were to add effects to it, like bit crusher and overdrive, turn the overdrive up slightly, you get, you get a whole. <laughs> This is all after, this is post production, post uh, recording, uh, effects changes to the, to the recording. And if I, but if I wanted to, just say if I, if, if, if I want to connect my speakers, which are over here, uh, um, I'll show you, all, all across to there. If I wanted to connect my speakers to it, um, then, um, then uh, I could, this is, this is a Valve King. And Valve King is like this is not Valve King. This is Amkit, Amkit, and uh, I just bought yesterday. They had a one day offer where you get all your all the uh, all the amps. And just say if I want to change the amp, uh, I think so. Here, these are the amps I've got. I've got Fargon. I've got London Century. I've got PV. I've got about five six, five PV amps. I've got. I have uh, Taos, rectifier, vintage, voltage, VATs. Then for and if I want to add, I got a fair few pedals too. I got about not about twenty pedals. And and basically what you can do is you just say you got Amkit running there in the inputs. In I uh, can you see that yeah, you got Amkit running in inputs. And you open effects, and you got Improvox, which is really good. You got some Vox. I don't know how to write that. I don't, I'm not very uh, uh, experienced with that one. And Vio is good. Vio, you got all sorts of crazy noises with it. Not crazy, but really funky noises and really experimental noises. See, that's just a taste of what it was like. Uh, but it's cut off because. It should be what I'm doing. I'm doing. I'm doing this on. Um, I haven't connected a guitar onto it. Uh, you need a um, need a Apple Jam or something like that to connect a guitar to it. Or uh, Taxam Taxam one of these. I could do that now. All right then. This might blow my speakers, but I'll be very upset if I blow my speakers. I might not. Okay. There we go. Now, I move this across. You see the setup, and this is this this task I'm I am I Z. Right, it's it's connected to my audio link, audio point, audio input on the iPad, and it's got a guitar cable, a guitar connection, and uh, it should work. There we go, we've got the guitar and the, and the lights on that the guitar is on. 
So we've got a bass guitar. We have a bass guitar connected to it. Just put it here. And this time, so we opened Beat Maker again, and we got that was track one. And we want another amp kit track. Oh, we've got Vio track now. We opened the Vio track. Uh, this is a scary bit. If I turn this on now. Okay, I'm kitchen not doing anything at the moment. Uh, we can choose some pedals. Uh, we don't want this one. We want acoustic. Uh, we want and this one. We want uh, a magic modulator. Okay, we want, that's that's the setup we want. And if I turn my guitar up. Okay, so we've got that. We need to get the Valking. Let's pick that up. Let me see now if I play the guitar. If I play the guitar. Okay, beat maker. Let's take this survivor out, out of the chain, and open a track called another M M Kit track, and we'll record an M Kit. Not on wire. So is it playing anything? Okay, why So, I don't know. There we are. The task cam is not working for some reason. Maybe the batteries have died. Yeah, I'll leave it there anyway. So it's 22 minutes. You can do all that. I'll carry on with that and see if I can get a producer track today. Or another track and just basic track or something. See what I can do. I'll check you later. See you later.